Hey Spuddies, Potato McWhiskey here and welcome back to Let's Play Civilization 6 as the Mali in the Gathering Storm expansion. Let's go ahead and check out the next few turns. Okay, so we... Uh, plus one error score for artifacts, plus one error score each time we complete a trade route. I think reform the coinage is our best move here because we have a lot of trade routes. We can actually get more. Let's go to Walata. I think this is the best city to build trade routes in right now. So we will just grab as many as we can. All right, that's the extra two that we didn't have there. Uh, we can build our campus research grants. I'm going to go back to maybe hard building a few things. Like, for example, we have campus, holy site, aqueduct, I could use an industrial zone in here. Do I really want to go for an industrial zone? It's not a bad move. It's really not a bad move to just get one. I could probably use more important stuff like entertainment complexes in here. Um, this is probably, this is a bad city to build an entertainment complex because it's kind of on the edge of my empire. So I might just leave this city the way it is. Um... It does need a neighborhood. This would get pillaged constantly over here. It would do okay over here. This isn't an amazing tile anyway. It would get occasionally pillaged over here. So I think we might slap that down there. <clears throat> and we just get a uh, neighborhood so we can work these specialist slots. Uh, let's go ahead and... I could put lumber mills in here. But I think I like the idea of having a few extra farms. So we'll go ahead and start chopping. I'm going to get a second builder to continue to develop this. Probably would be better to buy them in Liang City, but it's, you know, six of one, half a dozen of the other, as Papa Quill would say. All right, let's conjoin these together. That will give us the boost towards mobilization. We have our Ironclad here. There is a consideration to just delete the Ironclad because it's using one coal per turn. Are there boosts for getting the upgraded units? Three armies or armadas? Uh... Yeah, I think I'm just going to delete the Ironclad now. Like, it basically existed just to get me some boosts. So let's see here, who can we make friends with? Train a biplane, that's something we could do. Uh, train a battleship, that's something we could do. Religious conversion, great scientist, train a tank, send a trade route, train cavalry. Well, we can do the train a cavalry thing. I could have probably done that before the era score flipped over, but that's totally fine. I'll need a little bit more gold before I can do that. Um, so let's train a cavalry, train a tank, campus, religious conversion. Trade route, Rika for combustion. We will get that soon. Okay, so we've got some fairly difficult ones to pull off, so we might just kind of like semi ignore that for a while. Oh, right. Let's go ahead and see if we can get our uh, <coughs> get our thingies back, friendships and alliances, because they are very very valuable. Remember, they're giving us era score. Um, we want to make sure that we secure that. Let's get an alliance here. Military alliance with Dido. Sure thing. You'll pay me a little bit of gold with Coupe. Grab the research alliance. Sure. Uh, with Patrick Cootie. We'll get an economic alliance. He'll demand a little bit of gold. That's fine. And then with Wilfred Laurier, we'll get a religious alliance. Sure. That seems fine. Mainly looking to have those alliances for the nice boosts uh, to our error score generation. Cross that river, have a little bit of exploration over here. Never criticize a rifle, As a ranger, we could in theory upgrade this guy to a ranger. We are in allies territory and we'll go ahead and do that. Why not? He has, I think the rangers have a little bit more vision and stuff. All right, so gold, 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 gold. I love gold. All right, so there's nothing we can really pillage up here. May as well just go up here and level the unit up by shooting that city. Any of these city states want trade routes? No, nope. we'll trade with Vilnius anyway. Although this does technically give better yields because it has a better spread. But I'll go for the culture here. Seems like a totally reasonable thing to do. Trade with Istanbul. Uh, we're going to want another Bombard, another Musketman, and another Field... Or we want one of um, 
one of each of these so we can combine them together into armies which will give us the boost towards something that I can't remember it's combined arms yeah having three armies or armada so we'll probably get more of those did I I did delete that unit right I think I did because I don't want to burn too much coal I want to be careful about how much co2 I emit all right so the next polar melt is about to happen that might open me up actually up there to uh go around i want to start cutting down my co2 emissions a little bit we've been burning coal for a while we completed a sewer in here let's go ahead and build a workshop uh theater square completed let's get the sewer this city needs housing oh dear Well then, let's see what we can do to help this city. If we get an aqueduct. It'll help the city grow. Now it has eight housing, so it'll get another pop next turn. Um, we want a trade route over here to help it grow as well. It's going to be hard to keep this city in my empire, actually. So we might get some units moving over this way to make sure we can recapture it when it goes independent. I want that to become a cavalry too. That'll get us that. We'll move the crossbowmen over. You'll become a field cannon. I can actually combine you with these guys next turn. That's all the units I have. That should be able to retake that city. It doesn't have defenses yet. We'll get a trader in here to try to force a bit of growth in this city. Alright, we completed the Seguba. Do the commercial hub investment for now while we work on things. We'll try to get you stabilized. Let's see how many builds you have. That works right there. Queue up those moves. You move west. Uh, let's see... Maybe we'll put two trade routes in here to try to get the city to develop a little quicker. The ice is about to melt, so we might be able to sneak our way through here. I'm not sure what hit you, but I think it was the volcano exploding. So why don't you go here and heal up? Ah, uh, damn it. A, sp a spy successfully stole from Wallada, even though I have a, a spy defending. There's mobilization. For sure. The card we have now is locked in. So I could get Levy on mass. I actually kind of want plus one movement. It's nice for builders. I'll take that. Uh, theater square completed here. The festival that is. We must be getting close to some of these. I could purchase Alfred Nobel with faith. Let's make sure we have all the faith things. Oh right. I can almost purchase another district in here. Let's make sure we have all the faith things purchased. Could get some naturalists if I wanted to. Bank. We've mostly bought all the stock exchanges now with faith, which is really, really good. Which means our gold income is pretty good too. Although it is a little bit weaker than it was. Why don't you just get me sewers? And let's see, you have a Seguba. You can get another district. I'd like... A neighborhood in here. It's a plus five one on this tile that's gonna flood in the not too distant future. Here's not a terrible place. We have two envoys. Where can we make a difference? Definitely here. We'll take Antan and Arriva. We can actually take the Suzeranity here. And I think I will, because that's a lot of culture boost. Up to 200. Uh, we're getting 26% boost from that. So that's a really great one to pick up. That feels pretty damn good. Turn you into a field can so we can combine. Uh, and in fact, you're going to come back the way. Because I want you to combine with this guy. A couple cores should do the job. Uh, let's trade with Istanbul. Sorry, I actually wanted food in here, didn't I?
try and get this city to grow. It's already taken big loyalty penalties, though. It's not following my religion. I think that's one of the bigger problems. Do I have a little... Could get a couple of those guys out there. And yes, the ice did melt here, so we should be able to get a couple of pillages off up here. Uh, not take too much damage in return, actually. We might take a decent chunk. Religious alliance? I'm confused by that, but okay. That's a bit weird. A spy was had religious lines underneath his name. I wonder what would happen if I'd accepted that. Was that just a graphical bug? So there is uh, oil as a resource unlocked. Very cool. This aid request. Who is it? Wilfred Laurier. Let's just drop 500 gold on his head. That should secure me decent way towards winning. And over here we have more buildings available. Part, part of the problem in here is that the city is unhappy. So what if I got an entertainment complex? That would boost the loyalty by three. Which would buy us more time to flip the religion, which would buy us even more time. Uh, it's a one-turn water park, eh? I guess it's because we failed the other thing. So let's grab that. One-turn water park seems like a good deal to me, boys. I definitely want to get steel now. I also want flight, because I think there's someone wanting me to build a biplane. I'll grab that great scientist. Oh no, it was Alfred Nobel, or it was Albert Einstein that I wanted. Oh well, this one's not great. Some of the great scientists don't feel too amazing. I should have skipped this. Oh well, the campus research grants already. University, that would take way too long. Let's just do another campus research grant in here. Harvest that. Harvest that. Put some farms in here. All good, all Gucci Bucci. Gucci Bucci in the Scoochie. You go there. I want you to combine. Now we've got a Musketman army. I can just scooch by and pillage. Very nice. Should maybe have taken the promotion that gets pillaging with no movement. So these missionaries need to get over to here. The best way to go is this way. And we'll be able to uh, try to convert this city back. Man, we're having a hard time finding these uh, these artifacts. Gotta say. Looks like somebody's snatching them up ahead of us. First master your people. I show no signs of mastery. Well, screw you too, Sue the man, Sue the one, Sue the two, Sue the three, Sue the four, Sue the five, Sue the six. All right, we got the water park in here. Um, I'm just going to hard build the ferris wheel uh, here we'll do another we'll hard build the sewer keep putting farms down you're heading this way combine these together that's combined arms boosted now which is great that gets us a bit of pressure Okay, so now the loyalty should be only falling by one. So that buys us a lot of time to get this city's population up. Need this city's population to go up too. I guess because I used to have a cultural alliance with that guy. Oh, hello. More pillages. Free gold. Thank you. I think that also generates like an invisible war score. Oh, and I'll be able to pillage these stuff, this stuff here too. It's fantastic. You want to buy oil for two luxuries? I'll take that deal. That seems like a pretty fair deal to me. He thinks I'm devout? Alrighty. I think you're wrong. Is it worth it to spread my religion? Two gold for spreading it. Let's 
Probably not a bad move. Get a bit of pressure over here. Oh, wow. That's a lot of pressure. All right. We got our sewer in here. Uh, let's just slowly build a shipyard. Encampment training completed in here. Let's do another encampment training. Just trying to keep that city kind of busy. All right. That should give me the boost. I'll take a Laurier one. That should get me a boost for this tech. I think I already got this tech, actually. We're about to get flight. We will want to build a biplane. Um, we have revealed oil. Oh, have I already improved all the oil that I found? Looks like that might be true. We're losing some coal now. 15 from improvement. So I guess we've planted uh, all our districts on that, on this oil. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Apparently, clicking on up here opens the diplomatic screen. But yeah, we need to start... Um, we need to start cutting down our power need. So we're probably going to have to pick up electricity. That's three privateers. What the heck? Let's get some privateers. That'll boost that tech and we'll get it nice and quick. Because we're running out of coal reserves. And that is no bueno, mi amigos. Oh, I could upgrade this to a medic. Sure. And Oh, we just barely passed into the loyalty zone. Nice. Got two build charges left on this builder. The city could for sure use a couple mines. Look at these farms. Aren't they a thing of beauty? Uh, can we pop in here? Coastal raid. Oh, owie. We took some damage there, guys. I thought I would be able to dip in and then leave. But it didn't quite work out the way I'd hoped. So now we've got to pick up artifacts from somewhere other than his land. Or he'll be upset with me. More than he already is. There's a couple down here that we can grab. Workshop completed here in Timbuktu. I'm going to send an internal one over here because this city needs a bit of growth. Don't need a factory in here so we could just work some projects. Is there a particular great person? Ah, uh, Nikola Tesla's pretty good. And it'll save me a bit of coal power. Do that three times. It'll also generate me some gold. Let's see, what have you got for me? Food mark, you could do that in nine turns. That would get you more food. You already have pretty good food surplus. So I don't think I need that. I'd rather just get the housing in here. Uh, now we're going to organize this by uh, gold. A bit of better gold trading with Hungary. Alright, nice. Look at these food tiles. They a thing of beauty. It's going to really help us keep growing here. It's not much food over here, but it is a plus six, so it'll keep growing. Got one spare bill charge in here. I guess I could put a farm here. Why not? It gets adjacency from these. It'll spread the adjacency up this way. Let's go ahead and spread the religion. Bind these privateers together, keep them nice and tight, keep them nice and quiet. We'll bring the uh, bring the medic with this group. I had our units over here for the uh, purpose of protecting the city from a loyalty flip, but it turns out that didn't happen in the end. We're breaking it down. It's seven to two. Now it's six to four. Gotta try and spread my religion back here. It's a lot of pressure that built up in these cities. What else am I gonna spend my faith on, right? Um, got a holy site in here. Let's get a couple of apostles. That could be fun. It's the wrong religion. Let's make sure we have the right religion. Missionary and a missionary. We'll do a little bit of religion spread. Nothing too crazy. Uh, you can escape. 
So I traded a privateer for a few pillages. I think that was an okay trade. Looks like somebody just captured a spy. Good, 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 good. Suleiman is affected by a natural disaster. We will definitely want to go for that. We're going to have to try and figure out how we're going to generate a lot of diplomatic points if we're going to have a chance at a diplomatic win. I would like to win a diplomatic victory. Why don't you go ahead and protect that again? Uh, aid request. Three turns. I'm going to drop another 200 gold on this guy's head. Making it rain, baby. Make sure that I just secure that. Alrighty. Apostle. Pilgrim is pretty good. Alright, these all suck. So I will evangelize with you and I'll get a new apostle. And we'll go for scripture. It'll give me a little bit of extra uh, passive religion spread. Which is good power here. Good, good, good. A 50% increase, and I think we'll go for Pilgrim. Where's the nearest natural wonder? Right over here. So we'll get to this tile and we will take Pilgrim. This city is converting back. It's good to see. How are we doing in here? Good, 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 good. Got that nice pressure working on. I'm getting uh, religious, it must be trade routes. That's what it is. Uh, let's see. Bit of gold. Never did nobody no harm. There we go. We got that city to flip pretty easily. Get in over here. We got that city to flip. So maybe we'll try to flip a few of Hungary cities. Be annoying to him. Do some trading. I thought I told you to repeat your mission. But I guess I did it incorrectly. I must have clicked the wrong button. You guys can just go to sleep. You're not doing too much for me. All right, we've revealed most of the map, which is awesome. The only person I haven't revealed is up here with Sweden. I'm trying to look for like an exposed city where I could maybe pick up a few pillages. I guess you could run to that tile. Get a little closer. Got to watch out for these city shots. That's the thing we got to be concerned about. I know I have a builder. Trying to make its way home somewhere. I think it... Oh, I think that was actually this builder. This builder actually made it. Cool. That's awesome. It could actually be worth it to just declare a coastal... Like a war with privateers and just raid the shit out of people's coasts. That could be like a viable tactic in multiplayer and in stuff like that. So we have uh, this new... Uh, policies available to us, campus and industrial zones, and commercial hub and harbor. So our gold sh and science should shoot up a little bit. Nothing too crazy, but a decent increase. Um, I actually need the uh, food market here in my capital to help keep it growing. Still got tiles we can work in here. We're working this crappy kind of tile, but it's okay. It's still kind of shitty, but it's all right. <sighs> I guess I should build a kill with Kissa anyway at this point now. Why not? So, we got a lot of cities that we can make friends with. Quite happy with the suzerainty of these guys. Doing a little bit of building here. I don't want to build this, this is too expensive. You for sure could use a builder. Um, you could get an aerodrome for me right there. Hell yeah. It's a six turn aerodrome. Neighborhood completed, this city can keep growing. Would like the food market in here, but I can't afford it. So why don't you just build me a sewer nice and slow. Let's bring these guys up. So now you have six spreads, which is good to me. I'm going to attack out here on the, weekend, on the weakened wing. We've already put a bit of pressure on this city. We attack here, attack here, then swoop in for pest. Get that religious pressure rolling. Apostle. Ah, there we go. Translator is awesome. Let's get you moving this way. 
you're best going this way. Take translator. Making your way over this way. Oh, Karlstad went independent. That's really interesting. You want to buy my astrolabe? Nope. No, thank you. Appreciate the offer. Not going to take it. Annunciation. Uh, there's electricity. We are going to start switching over to oil power here. We've got a lot more oil and it produces a lot less emissions. So uh, let's go ahead and queue up the convert to oil power. Now the oil power plant is worse. Um, there's a way to check it. I'm allowed to show this now. See the coal power plant uh, gives you bonus adjacency, whereas the oil power plant is just plus three production. So I might keep this oil power plant around because it's really, really good. But like, for example, this one, the adjacency isn't amazing. If we check this out in the building screen, the coal power plant's only plus four. So we'd only really be losing like one, one, one production from this from converting to oil, but we are producing a lot less CO2. So we'll go ahead and switch over to oil and we'll be uh, diversifying our power sources. I also need to look for another one. I think I'm burning coal over here too. This is a really good coal power plant. I'm trying to remember where I have my power plants. Uh, I think I only have actually these two. And then this one down here. Wish there was like an electricity screen. Let me see. Is there a way to see? Uh, perhaps. Oh, there's a screenshot mode. Oh, yes. My mods. My mods are working again. Oh, it's beautiful. Thank you so much, Secret Tech. You are awesome. So there's a coal power plant. So you can actually tell what's his coal power plant here, coal power plant here. So I think those are the only ones I have, actually. Um, I definitely want to get the nuclear power, though. It basically produces none. Um, what's our next steps? I think somebody wanted me to produce a tank. Um, getting access to aluminum would be good. We'll go ahead and check that out. Go ahead and trade for gold. Alright, so let's start converting this city. Hello. Free kill. Hell yeah. Alright, I've already converted that city. We'll put one we'll put one conversion into it. Nope. My gods must be appeased. My gods are better anyway, so I don't mean like why wouldn't you follow my god? Then we're gonna convert pest. We'll get a couple of missionaries over here actually. We'll actually get the stock exchange as well, because we've got some cities up here that need to be converted. Start putting that little bit of pressure up here, get more of our people to get more of these people to follow my religion. I have a little bit of pressure built up in here, which is helpful, but not quite as much as I'd like. Um, let's see here, we've got some, some of our own pressure. You get to this city. You sneak past Karlstad. Looks like Karlstad is heading over to the Inca. Karlstad's having a real bad time. Oh no, a spy happened. Ah, we captured a spy in Wallada. That's great. You can have my iron for open borders. That seems like a fair deal. I'm at war with a cod? It's the first I've heard about it. Hey, we mitigated the flood. Nice. We can also get hydroelectric dams uh, in here. That'll be a good thing to pick up. I could just purchase that. How many, where do I have dams? I have a dam over here. I can get power over here. I think that's all of them, actually. So we got a hydro dam here. It's plus six power. Sewer so completed in here. We could use a little bit of extra growth. Um, there's no reason not to. But we'll go ahead and grab the food market so that we can fill this city out with population and work all these tiles. Uh, up here in Nioro. We've got housing in here now. Ooh, seaports are good for me. 
we'll go ahead and get the sewer, get the cheap buildings out of the way while we save up gold to do all these things that we want to do. Let's go there. Spread our religion a little bit. So right now, right now there is a decent amount of pressure. We've almost already taken over that city. Take it over soon. Let's get you up in here. You up in here. Plus 200 cash money isn't much, but it does erode the other religions, which is good. You can't quite move. Ooh, dodge that if you can. Oh, you're going to take a shot from Carlstead now. That's actually really bad. Hmm. I didn't think that through properly. These guys are pretty tanky, though. Gotta say. All right, there is democracy. So we're going to go ahead and pick democracy in. I'm going to do it this episode, actually, and set up our government, because I'll forget to do it next episode. <laughs> All right, we'll pick up democracy here. Mostly our government will be unchanged with the exception of the New Deal. I would like to have this triangle in trade. This is worth like 80 gold. Um, and I want to put in Merchant Confederation because that's going to give me gold as well. Now, Vissel Banking is pretty good. Put the extra gold here. Feels really, really nice. Um, Holy Side Adjacency feels pretty good to me too. I could put in Mercantile Legacy and a few of these other cards. But I think all these nice kind of spread of bonuses do really, really nicely for us. You should see our gold shoot up. Boom, boom, boom. Nice, nice, nice. We're in a good spot. Could you get in here and get ready to pillage? Are oh, you going to take a pretty bad shot? Whoops. Oh, well. And, uh, yeah, we'll make more decisions about this game in the next episode. I want to thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys are enjoying this series. Please remember to subscribe if you want to see more videos from me. Remember to leave a like if you want to directly support my channel. And remember to leave a comment if you want to give me your feedback. Other than that, I want to say I love you all very much. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.